that's what the Fraser looked like before the project. That cannot sustain aquatic life. No. Um, see how, how wide, wide the water open, spread yeah. and, and these rocks heat up and that water heats up. And when the flows are low, then it gets pushed into this inner stream channel where it remains completely healthy. So we have a healthy wide spring channel and a healthy narrow low flow channel. To bid on this project, Clint was one of the bidders. And what our interview process was, was more to learn about their philosophy and stream channeling work rather than their uh, price. You could build rock dams and have deep holes yep. full of fish this has really nice holes with obviously nice fish because you yeah. caught some of them. A couple. The holes though are kept at a proper depth to move sediment. The deep holes hold sediment. Collect. So so Clint does build holding water for trout, but he builds it at a depth where sediment can continue to move. Uh, another thing that he does exceptionally well, we found nice fish, but we didn't have to fish what looked like a pond.